Hi, how's it going? Just another quick update on our little game project called Omada. Um, what I have been working on is better hit detection, uh, improved rag dolls, and sword trails, anim trails on the swords, which is uh, working quite well. Um, let me, without crapping on too much, I will show you what I mean. So, we've got my three little characters, uh, prototypes, just running around. I've modelled some new weapons. And, as you can see, I've got a, an anim trail flowing off the back of my sword, which can be switched on and off. Uh, so the, the idea is it's only there when you swing. And I'll show you how to set up. What I've also got is better blood... <laughs> Dynamics, so the blood drains from the player. He leaves a little trail, so he could, if he was to hide around a corner, you could for the run away and hide. You'll be able to follow exactly where he went, uh, and it has a, a nice little bit of action on the blood deck. So at the moment we've got the we've got the uh, farmer with his axe, uh, and the the rag dolls have have been considerably improved. Uh, with a little angular dampening, but I still need to work a little bit on that, but they don't fly off into the distance anymore. All right. But you can still push the ragdoll around. So, yeah, this is what it looks like. Um, well, actually, before I go any further, check out the new... New weapons. Uh, I've got now. I've got three skinned players just with a wander task. We've got a uh, uh, the new mallet with a really. What I did get was a really nice texture for the handle. Uh, the heads need a little bit of work, but yeah, an axe and the katana you've seen before. So the gang's all here. These are the three main classes. To explain a little bit for you, you've got your builder, you've got your farmer, and you've got your assassin or ninja, and they all have different roles. But we, I won't go too too far into that right now. Okay, so let me explain the sword trails for you so what I'll do first is this is set up so they're on all the time uh, I've got a little on tick sending um, it, that receives a um, uh, when to attack the damage which is notified from the animation um, so that the damage isn't on all the time only when the sword's swinging halfway through so as it's got a bit of momentum and that uh, enables the collision so that it will hit but tagged on the end of that, I've got the trail, so only when the sword is uh, has the collision on will you see the trail. So I'll show you that now that I've uh, fixed it, swapped it back around. And there's the trail. So when everyone's fighting each other, there'll be nice little sword trails. To uh, And you can see those hits are working really nicely. And the ragdolls, don't, he doesn't fly off into the distance, but you can sort of still push him around. Which is good fun. All right, so the the thing with the part, what you have to do to make a sword trail is make a particle that has an anim trail data. Um, you can't preview it live after you've done that, which is a bit of a pain. But you set it up first. Mine's really simple. It's just got color over life. So it's uh, over here on the on the right over here. You can see it's got two different colors, a red through to a blue with a with a fade, which gives you that nice purple. Um, and then the important thing is that you have a socket. It gets the sockets. Uh, you have a bone on your weapon, and then add sockets to it. And you basically making a line from one socket here. It's the handle socket to the blade socket, and it draws the trail on that. Um, you have to have a uh, because in the blueprint um, you can see that it has a handle socket and blade socket here from the center in width one. It's just the full width. Um, it was a bit of trial and error to get this working. People use uh, um, is visible and different things, but uh, that's what worked for me. Uh, make sure you get your anim trail as as your particle. Uh, this really good uh, YouTube. Um, there are some good, uh, really great particle uh, um, tutorials on the from the Unreal website that you should look at for sure. And that one is uh, just particles in Unreal Engine 4 which I followed all of those, did all the things, and now have uh, can do the, the trails. So hope you uh, enjoyed that little update, and, um, yeah, keep an eye on this space. Cheers.